What's up, dudes? Alright, so I want to talk to you guys about the uh, C Clone 100 protein skimmer I got. Uh, right there. You get this at like most of your like local stores, Petco and PetSmart and whatnot. It's pretty cheap, it's about 100 bucks. Um, so far, it's been an alright skimmer for me. It's cleaned out lots of the poop in the uh, urine and everything inside the uh, container. You can see it just building up on the inside. Look at it real quick. Right up in here. Um, it says to give it a few days so that you can actually, you know, let it start building up the foam and everything on the inside. And I was reading some reviews online about it. There's a bunch of mixed reviews. I know a lot of the uh, complaints that people are having are for like the micro bubbles and stuff that keep building up. Um, in all honesty, if you like read through the instructions, it actually tells you that. There's going to be some of the micro bubbles for a little while, but um, it will go away after a few days. Mine actually did go away. The only reason that there's the bubbles in there right now is I put this uh, plankton in there to feed the coral to help them grow. Um, it's definitely cleaned out the water. It was really cloudy before I got this. I was just doing the water changes because I didn't want to invest in the skimmer, but I went ahead and did it anyways, and I definitely enjoy it. Um, only serious problem I can say about the C Clone 100 is uh, this piece right here. That's the pump that they have. The impeller, these little plastic pieces, start breaking off inside the tank. And I called the uh, company on the phone number that they have on here, and they're sending me a new one. But they said that they're actually changing those out. I guess they've been having problems with them in the first place. But uh, if you look inside here, you might be able to see them. Down there on the bottom somewhere. I don't know if you can see them on this, but yeah. Down on the ground and the seabed over there, there is some uh, purple plastic pieces from the impeller. All in all, I would suggest getting this if you're starting like a miniature tank. It says it's up to 100 gallons. I wouldn't go that high with it. Uh, probably 65 gallons would be the max that would go on this skimmer here. But it is good. It does the job. I've definitely seen a huge amount of clarity in my fish tank, and uh, I would just suggest getting this if you're going cheap and just want to get one from the store. They do have some cheaper ones on Amazon, but I don't know how those work. Um, yeah, so if you have any questions about the skimmer that I can answer, I'd be more than happy to answer them. Just leave it on the uh, comments below.